Hey guys, my name is Yvette and welcome to my DIY channel and I hope that you guys are having a great day. So I wanted to share two air dry clay projects that I made and I made a set of boho magnets and an incense holder. So let's get into it. All right guys, so for this first project, we're gonna be making some boho magnets and I bought these outlines on Etsy. I'll link them in the description box for you guys. Anyways, print them out to the size of your liking and then these are going to be our stencils. Roll out your clay and trace out your shapes. Blend out any rough spots with some water. If you decide to do this little face, make sure to trace it out before you lift off the paper. Using a dotting tool, I'm going to trace out the face a little bit better. Once again, don't forget to trace out any details in your stencils before you lift off the paper. And then again, I'm using a dotting tool to trace out my details. Make sure you do any last minute adjustments to any of your little shapes and then let these guys dry for about two days. Much, much, much later. So here are our little boho shapes dry and now I'm just going to sand them. Now that they're all nice and smooth, it's time to paint. I'm going to use Deco Arch triple thick gloss glaze to seal these. I got these little magnets on Amazon a while ago and I'm going to use some E6000 to glue these onto my little shapes.
Okay guys, so going back to these boho shapes that I bought on Etsy, I'm going to use these two here for my incense holder. Make sure to print them out to the size of your liking because these are going to be our stencils. I also made sure to trace out a rectangle that would comfortably fit my shapes. And then I also sketched out a little boho face that I wanted to add to my sun. Okay guys, so take whatever clay you're using and roll it out and then trace out your rectangle shape. Make sure to blend out the edges with some water to make it nice and smooth. We're going to move on to our moon shapes, so make sure to trace them out. Going back to my rectangle, I'm adding some water to make it tacky and then I'm just going to attach my little shapes and you could even add some scratches to the back of them to make them stick better but I didn't. Taking an incense stick, I'm going to stick it into my clay where I want mine to go. Do any last minute adjustments and then let this guy dry for about two days. A little longer than a few minutes later. Now that our incense holder is dry, I'm gonna sand it. I'm gonna prime this with a white coat of paint and then I'm just gonna start painting. And then right here, I decided I wanted to speckle. The last thing I'm going to do is seal this with Deco Arts Triple Thick Gloss Glaze. Alright guys, so that's it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I have a bunch of other air dry clay projects on my channel, so check those out if you want more ideas. And subscribe for more DIYs, and stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!